Alright guys, welcome back to Let's Play Rune Factory 2, A Fantasy Harvest Moon. In the last episode, we finally did it. We're in the second generation, and now we're playing as Arya, who likes to shake her butt and have a good time. <laughs> this is, that's a weird statement to say about a child. It's true. It's true for most children, though. If you've ever raised a child, you know it's true. I hope to raise a lot. I, you know, don't have the kids, but dang if I don't take care of a lot of them. Ah, drinking tea. It's very nice. All right. So, there isn't a huge amount we can do today, but if we come here to the farm, then we can take a look at all the work I did. I put down nine things of turnip seeds, or pink turnip seeds specifically. So now we have stuff to work with. All right, onward! So Arya mentioned something about a message on the bulletin board. What's that about? I need supplies for class. I need you to get me some materials to use in class. Come see me for details. Um, I guess I read your note on the bulletin board. But what do you want? I saw your request on the bulletin board. Oh, you did? Thanks for coming. Let me explain. I thought I could use scrap iron in my next class, but I'm completely out. Could you bring me another piece of scrap iron? Since it's for your own class anyway, I thought you'd want to help out. Of course! Thanks, Arya. Alright, one scrap iron coming up! Which, normally you'd have to mine this. This is why you want to try to get a lot of these materials now, because otherwise you are going to be in trouble. The monsters hit hard. I'll show that off towards the end of the day, how hard they hit, but it's not one damage anymore. Oh, apparently you can't do it from the other side of the... Well, that's unfortunate. Well, we live with our mistakes. You got it. Great, thanks. Now I can further improve your lessons. Here's something for your help, Arya. Thanks. You got missing page one. Hell, you know if I need any more help. Hmm. Missing page one. I wonder what that's for. Alright, if we open up our inventory, all we have to do is look at this. A page from the Cure magic book describes how to use powerful magic. That's right. What we're doing is we're learning real magic, more than just fireball. How hurls a blazing ball of fire. However, the book is badly damaged. If we were to get fireball missing pages, then we would be able to do that as well. It's great. I love it here. We all love it here. Magic is finally ours. Wait, that sounds malevolent. Clipping time. Ba 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 da ba 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 da ba ba da ba ba. I now have a full stack of each of these on my person, and I believe also in my storage. So that's good crap. Hey, Mom. Hey there. Hi there, Arya. Arya, study hard and become a fine adult. I'm curious. Can I give this? I can't give this. I came to buy. <laughs> so... The weapon shop has been expanded. You have the broadsword, which is what we've been using up to this point. We also have the steel sword, a short sword forged from steel. Its long blade gives its extended reach for nearly, for over four times the price. Four and a half times, or no, four, 405% of the price, I guess. There's the Zweihander, the lance, the war hammer, which is what I think I was confusing the name with, with the battle hammer at first. The poleaxe, the staff, the bronze shield. So just a straight up upgrade, so that's worth using. And nothing else. Now first things first, we're going to want to sell our broadsword. I would not recommend you guys to do this, but I need the inventory space for the moment. We will also be purchasing... No, we won't even bother purchasing a bronze shield. We'll be able to do... To make our own weapons and stuff. But this is a good option immediately if you want to. Now, if you remember, we got a fireball from here before. The Colors of War, the only book about fighting you'll ever need, hmm? But none of this seems that interesting. Instead, if we come here... Hmm? What's this? It looks like a magic book! You got the magic book Escape. Yeah, I got Escape! 
after a thousand years. Escape. Very useful magic that whisk you away to safety faster than you can say there's no place like home. I love that little reference. We can now finally teleport after all this time. It costs us nothing. It's just fantastic. So, let's say you head up here and you're like, Oh no! Monsters! And you're like, NEVER! And you're back to the entrance. And then if you leave there, and you want to teleport with the same spell instead of two different spells, you get home. A major upgrade from the first game. Want to try some training? Come see me, Kay. Quest can be replayed. We're gonna start with this. We need to get stronger fast. We have to wait a while until we can do a lot of the quests here because we just don't have the inventory space for the rewards. But, if we do Tanya's request, we can at least start making progress. And things have changed with Tanya. She does not, instead of... She no longer has three quests. She now has a crap ton of them. It's great. Oh, you saw the bulletin bubble. You saw the bulletin board, are ya? I have something I want to talk to you about. Your dad was quite a skillful fighter. He took out powerful monsters one after the other and really honed his skills. The number of monsters he defeated, why, there are enough stars in the sky to count them. People were even starting to whisper about him being the next legendary swordsman. My dad was that strong? Mom never said anything about that. He was really amazingly skilled. Therefore, that means that you need to become a skilled fighter just like your father was. I want you to train hard and become skilled with a blade too. You want me to train to be a fighter? That's right. They don't teach you about that in school, do they? Uh, no. And what kind of training do you need in order to become a great fighter? Trials, that's what. Trials? That's, yes, trials. So without further ado, let's get started then. Um, okay. To start with, head to Trieste Forest. Defeat ten pom-poms, then come back and talk to me. Oh, you're not scared of monsters, are you, to Arya? No, I'm not scared. Good, then the first step to being a fighter like your father. Now, head off to Trias Forest. Okay. The reasonable thing would be to take your sword and try to do all this fighting and stuff, and that's fine. Whatever. I'm not going to do that. Instead, I'm going to see how I measure up, and how, more importantly, Sylvie, a level 10 monster, measures up to these unleveled pom-poms. Get on the Sylvie's back! Okay, so pom-poms spawn here. So, they deal 3 damage. Okay, pom-poms, not that bad. Still, much more than they used to deal, though. So, that's unfortunate, but that's fine. Trius Forest is the beginning dungeon. As such, it won't be as hard. Oh, an apple. I'm gonna stick a... I'm gonna stay away from them. Because I know that they're pretty dangerous. I'll let them hit me once if I don't get hit naturally. Oh, it's a separate level. Okay, that's fine. I should probably just leave Sylvie to it. Good job, Sylvie. Let's hit me. Oh, these ones are not strong. Okay, good to hear. So, Trias Forest, not that bad. I know that the ones over in uh, Padova Mountains, way worse. We'll be showing the difference in level. Uh, here. Trias Forest, the temperate climb is perfect for spring vegetables. Danger level 3 out of 6. Okay, that would be why. It's still way stronger, but it's only a 3. Padova is a 6. Alright. And while we're thinking about it, because we did get it, an apple! An apple a day keeps Tanya at bay. Oh, that's very thoughtful of you. I really like apple. Thanks. Thank you. Great, it looks like you've managed to feed the required number of pom-poms. Your sword skills have truly improved then, correct? S However, this is only the beginning. There's still plenty more I need you to do. I never used a sword. I sold my sword, do you remember? In any case, here's your reward. 500G. Thank you. Oh, that reminds me. If you want to become even stronger, you'll need to build a dojo. Then you'll be able to learn all sorts of useful combat skills. Let me spell it out for you. A dojo is super important. Remember that. Talk to the mayor when you want to build one. 
Anytime you want to try another challenge, just come on back. I'll turn you to a lean, mean fighting machine. Oh, it's you, Arya. I wonder just how good you are with a sword, Arya. I'm decent. Hey there, Arya. You look lively today. You look lively today. Uh, I don't remember how to do his voice, to be honest. I guess for now, I'll do some farming here. Try to clear out more space. Weed, sorry. Weed, sorry. Weed, sorry. Can you hurry back already? Douglas now mans the shop all by himself and collects our uh, ship bin stuff. So he essentially shuts down his shop even earlier than before. I'm not positive. This may be the one where he gets back right before 6 so you can still get in that time. So we'll try to do that in a minute. I'm gonna go with a solid no, considering that's happening. Yeah, so he won't be here at 6 then. So he no longer runs the store after like 3 or 4 p.m. That's unfortunate. I shouldn't visit at this hour. Okay, well that's what happens. Interesting. Huh. Unfortunate. Well, sadly I can't buy more seeds, because I want to have infinite energy going. My goal is to very quickly have infinite energy and just start power leveling everything. I want to be max on all the crafting skills very quickly and just start cranking out high level stuff quickly. I want this to be as fun as freaking possible. So instead, I farm. Mind you, I know that I can't do anything about old stumps and everything, but I can at least take care of all these. If I had thought about this, I would have bought more seeds, but, you know, you can't always get what you want, but if you try real hard, you can get what you need. So we've essentially used two bars of energy, more than at this point, but I also ate some herbs to heal up. So, we're good. <laughs> we're doing pretty good. I'm going to save here, and we're going to see what the monsters in Padova do, do to us at this point. Because it's pretty different. So, that does 28 to Sylvie now. And I only do one. Yeah. So, significant change. And so he's gone. How about you? What do you do to me? Uh, 47 damage, I believe. We'll see with the next hit. Yeah, 47 damage per hit. So I could use that to calculate what his strength is by that point. If we were to come over here, let's try healing up a little bit. 50, over 50 per hit. And it can hit us multiple times in a row. And it can hit us from off screen as you might guess. Yeah. But, one huge difference, you remember these, right? Grown-ups are too big to get through this fence, but I bet I could get through. That's right, we have access to the rest of the dungeon now. As, you know, you might have guessed. We're going to die here, but I want to show off a bit of it. I want to run up here. I get the feeling something's been here, but it's gone right now. I think I'll look in another cave. Interesting. What does it say? Defeat four Tundras at Padova Mountain Shrine. Tundras? Hmm. wonder where that is. Weird. I just wanted the beeping to stop. 
I... I'm gonna keep going until I die or just get bored and leave. What does it say? A gem that is as blue as the ocean. Bring me four of them. A blue gem? Uh... Yeah. That would be four Agua Marine. Sure, why not? Let's do it. Look, writing's starting to show up. Um, now what? The king of all gems, bring me three of them. The king of all gems? Three diamonds. It's disappearing. Obtain the ice stone tablet fragment. Well then, let's keep going. Uh... Yeah, one out of five. Written in ancient earth script. It seems to be a part of a larger tablet. I wasn't really planning on doing this. I wanted to either die or... D I don't know. We'll see in a minute. So, as you might guess, you don't want to get hit by these. They're not great for your health. But you can do mining and fishing. No, not fishing. Just mining in here. If you remember, there is a uh, cure spell now. If you get the cure spell... You can use your RP to heal yourself, rather than carrying around healing items. It's a pretty good method to do it. Oh, wah -ha. Let's see how this goes. Let's keep on running. Running through the 90s. Boo -boo 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 -doo. Did you just see that golden wolf? Oh my gosh, it did. Which is why I wanted to show you can get a better wolf companion than Sylvie. And we will do that soon. Even if it kills me. I just need to get healing items. This would probably be the best place to do it. Just a sec. I'm gonna... Huh. That's convenient. Let's give it a shot. I don't mind dying today. Probably can't do this with the amount of healing items I have on me currently, but, you know, we can give it a shot. <laughs> yep, no, we're done. And that is game over. I'm not going to bother filling in the map again, it's just not necessary, but I do want to go in real quick and take care of that one stone statue, so give me just a moment. Oh, and real quick, while it's starting up still, we can show one big difference. That's right. The actual opening is different now, with the red number two and everything. Because, like I said, blue just doesn't fit this game. Red does. It's so... I love this. It's great. Factory too. Rune Factory 2! They're so cute! Arya. Arya and Kyle. Wonderful. I need a total of three. It's still not enough yet. So you can give them in parts. That's why I wanted to confirm. It's disappearing! Obtain Ice Stone Tablet Fragment. Well then, let's keep going. Alright, perfect. Nope. Yeah, so fighting these things with magic is pretty rough. And they heal off every slice. And I only deal one damage, so not worth currently. Okay, now that we've checked that out, let's check out Trieste Forest. The first one. What does it say? A fast green vegetable the same color as cherry blossoms. I want to eat three of them. So we're going to have to wait a bit to do this because I had to sell off my pink turnips just to be able to uh, get inventory space. Fast green pink vegetable, what's that supposed to mean? Awesome. But that's fine. Just a few days. So there's a lot of mining spots here. 
So Trias Forest is a lot more profitable now. You just have to get rid of one monster spawner. Which, just a second, these are just regular... Yeah, these are pretty much regular orcs. Yeah, there is a lot of mining to do here now. I may as well take advantage of it. If I could stop missing! Skill up. That is precisely what I hope for, but also I keep missing. <laughs> Thanks to the fact that we know how to read a map. Let's check out down here. Cronups are too big to get through this fence, but I bet I could get through. Hence the hint hint, you can go through here now kind of thing. Oh, more training rocks. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Ah, dang it, Silva, you had to get poisoned. Uh, nope. <laughs> These things suck to fight. And now we can come up here. And there's a single orc archer. So, two more sources of rune points here. And if you can read a map, we've actually explored a huge portion of Trias Force just in this first day. There are two regions left. There is the region to the west, right up here, which you can't get to yet. And then up north, where we normally have all of our crops. Might as well check these. Ah, that's rough, buddy. It's fine, though. You can still get apples and everything. Just know that we don't want to head north yet. It would not be a good time for us. We would have a very, very bad time. You can go there if you want, and maybe you're strong enough to handle that. Just be careful. Make smart decisions. I already have a monster following me. I better not go inside right now. First time I've seen that with her. Now I'm going to spend the last of my energy just training up my lumber skill. So, hard cut tomorrow morning. Go. So now we get the bed our father used to sleep in all to ourselves. I hope mom enjoys her current bed. All right. I love the music. It makes it so much better than the first generation's music. To bless ya! Oh, there she is. I want a bargain. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sold out of bargains today. What? What? Now don't you go off any place dangerous, okay? You're still just a kid, you know. So if we come inside and go to the left, we have access to this. Did you know that you can play Suga Sugoroku here, Arya? Sugoroku? Yes, you can play with nearby friends, and you can even play with those who are far away. I can? Pretty neat, huh? You should try it out. Sugoroku is one of those online features that you can't use far away anymore, but if I had two people playing next to each other, we could do it. If I can figure out how this works on emulator, I will absolutely do it. Otherwise, someday if I get my 3DS fixed, I will try to cover this mode in detail. It all depends on which way this is going to go. There is more to that, but for now, if we head over here, this is the dojo and the forge, I believe. No, this is the workshop, I believe. Yeah, this is the workshop. It's pretty bare, though. And no one's even here at the school. It's weird that they leave it open, but I appreciate it because if I had to wait until school hours just to be able to use it, that'd be very, very unfortunate. Ah, yes, incredibly unfortunate. So, I believe if you check these, you can actually get stuff, but I'm full in inventory, so I shouldn't do that right now. Now... 
right here. Alvarna Academy Dojo. Open from 9 a.m. to 10 p.m. This is the dojo. We'll get into that another time. Okay, so I checked the list. And, um... Yeah. Uh, Tuesday, I forgot Tuesday and Thursday. She just doesn't have things for us. It's always sold out. So unfortunate. We can buy our first stuff starting tomorrow. And we'll have so much better stuff tomorrow. It's great. So we won't be able to do a lot of the forging for this first week from the looks of it. You would have had to have bought it on the Monday and, uh, well, we physically couldn't buy on Monday. So starting next Monday, we can start all of our forging endeavors. For now, water time! At least that means we'll have all of the energy set up for this now. We'll have it all by Friday, I think that's about correct? Just also means I have to spend a couple hours every day watering. I have a monster with me. I shouldn't go inside. I just wanted to be sure that Sylvie couldn't. Morning. Morning, Aria. Why are there monsters? Okay. Yeah, I already did this. Do you like school, Aria? Yes, yes, I do. I don't know why I tried to go in. I knew that wouldn't work. <laughs> Class time! Good morning. Good morning, Arya. Have you heard of pizza? I really love it. I've heard they have all sorts of pizza in the t in a town of Norad. I'm quite jealous, I must admit. Ah. Interesting. Good morning. Good morning, Arya. Why does everyone think I'm a girl when they first meet me? That's just silly. It's because you're cute. And apparently only girls can be cute. I don't know. Good morning. Morning. What do you want? There's nothing going on here. Nothing fun to see. Alright. Let's take a lesson. Um. Okay. So we have choices now. We're not going to be able to make any of these until next week anyway, so let's start with bread and rice. Okay then, let's begin. We'll start with bread. Need flour with water to make dough, then let it rise. So the flour. Did you understand? Next we'll try making toast. Take some bread and put it in the oven until it's browned. Did you understand? Next let's try making a rice ball. Take some steamed rice, then shape it into a triangle. Now, we'll make a salmon rice ball. Just like before, take some rice in your hand. Before shaping it, however, put a salted salmon in the center. Then shape the rice and you're done. Finally, let's try making a baked rice ball. Bake a rice ball in the oven until they're lightly browned. Super simple. Today, instead of food, let's learn some recipes for useful medicines. First, we'll make a recovery potion. To begin, you'll need an empty bottle. Next, carefully wash a medicinal herb, then grind it up. Then, put some green grass in water and bring it to a boil. There, it's finished. Next is an antidote potion. This is very important medicine. Don't forget it. First, take some leaves of an antidote herb. Just like before, mix some green grass with water, then mix the antidote herb into it, and it's finished. Next, we'll try a cure for paralysis. It's called Paragon. First, take some leaves off some yellow grass. Next, just like before, add a medicinal herb. Add a medicinal herb to boiling water, then mix in the yellow grass and it's ready. Next, we'll make a round off. It has an odd name, but I guarantee you it works. First, get a medicinal herb. Then, add some blue grass. The blue grass is used to relieve stress. Finally, add some purple grass. There, it's done. 
Finally, we'll make some cold medicine. Remember, only use this when you're really sick. Let's start with some red grass. This will give you a lot of energy. Next, add some green grass. It tastes bitter, but it works well. Then add some orange grass. It also gives you energy. Finally, add a leek. This is used to harden the outside, and that's all. You're finished. Did you understand my instructions? If you don't understand, please ask me again. That's all for today. Okay. Well, we can't talk to our mom when she's working, so that's sad. Oh well. Alright. We're gonna buy six of these, I believe. Oh, hey, Mom. Good morning, Arya. Arya, study hard and become a fine adult. Yeah, that's all we care about. You never see me for who I truly am! Powerful! Oh, I could have bought one more. I'll go buy one more. Pink turnip seeds. Done. That's a decent bit. So, on to the next classes. Hiya, Arya. Hello. I'll be sure to watch out for you, Arya. Hey there. Hey there, Arya. Your dad can do anything, Arya. He's a really clever guy. Yeah, same stuff as before. Hiya, Hiya Arya. Hiya. Hiya, Arya. I hope you can become closer friends, Arya. Yeah. I want to exercise. The school doesn't have a field we can play on or anything. I just want to curl up with my books. I want us to be good friends, Arya. Me too. Alright. I want a lesson. We're gonna keep going down all these lists. Alright, class time. First we'll learn how to make a steel sword. Here's what you'll need. Start with a broadsword. Next, you'll need some bronze to reforge the blade. Then, add a piece of iron. Finally, add one more piece of iron. What do you think? Got it? Next, we're gonna learn how to make a Zweihander. First, you'll need a claymore. Next, add a piece of bronze. Add another bronze. Finally, add a piece of iron. Make sure you don't warp the blade when you hit it. What do you think? The last thing I'll teach you how to make is a lance. You'll start by using a spear. Next, add a piece of bronze. Then, add another piece of bronze. Lastly, add a piece of iron. Now, wasn't that easy? Okay. I want a lesson. Time to start class. Weapons for Beginners 2. First up today is a war hammer. Here's what you need. Start with a battle hammer. Next, you'll need a piece of bronze. Add another piece of bronze. Last but not least, you'll need a piece of iron. What do you think? Next, I'll tell you how to make a powerful pull axe. Let's get started. First, you'll be needing a battle axe. Next, add a piece of bronze. Here's still one short, though. Add another bronze. Finally, add a piece of iron and you're done. What do you think? Pretty self-explanatory at this point. Next up, a staff. This one will be a little different. First, you'll be needing a rod. Next, you'll need a plant stem. Then, add a spore. This is used to boost the magic power of the staff. After that, add a root. Then, an insect skin. You sure you're gonna remember all this? Last up is a toy herb. There, that's it. What do you think? Got it? Yeah, I got it. Thank you, Mr. Barrett. Trial Orc. Time for training. Come see me, Kay. It's a good excuse to get out there and actually play in the dungeons and get some more experience. 
Which reminds me, I've gotten a few kills, and I'm already almost a quarter of the way to level 16. Awesome. If a trial, are ya? That's great, more trials and fighting is always a good thing. This time, I want you to defeat 10 orcs for me, okay? You already seem pretty skilled, so this shouldn't be a problem for you. My only device, don't let your guard down. You can find orcs in Trieste Forest. Now then, off you go. Take care out there. Alright. We're still without a weapon, because I like handicapping myself. And also because I don't have the inventory space for it. So, instead, we'll be just fighting with magic. Running through the 90s. Ba -ba -da -ba 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 -da. Okay. And this is where the orcs will spawn. Spawn? What? There we go. Uh, apparently only one will, though. The other one will spawn another monster, which we haven't run into before. Defeated five. Perfect. Ah, uh, that was from the orc. I thought it was from the other one. I don't want any of the cheap cloth, though. We have enough of that, and I know it's low level or whatever, but... There we go. All ten of them have been defeated already. Oh. There we go. That's what we needed. If we can get another one, then I'll be very fortunate. Specifically another one that's the same level. Is it the same level? It is. Perfect. See you, Sylvie. Okay. The root. The root of a tree, used as raw material for weapons, also ground up and used in medicine. We'll be shipping one of these. As you know, it's never been on the ship list before, so that's perfect. And we'll use the other one for upgrading and stuff later. But that means we're completely full on inventory. Oh no. Hey, Grandpa. Hey there, Arya. You look lively today. You helping your mom out every day, Arya? Yes, of course. I thought... Let's see. Maybe it's Mom who does it? Hi there, Arya. Arya, steady hard and become a fine... No. I thought there was a way to get... Lunches. Okay. It's not here, that's why. Impressive, you defeated the orcs. Just like I thought you would. You've got sword skills just like your father, despite you not using a sword and only using a magic in that wolf of yours. I have a reward for you. 600G. I'll give you another battle hint then. I'll sell you stronger weapons once you've the skills needed to wield them. If you really want powerful weapons, well, you just need to defeat the bigger monsters in the depths of the dungeons. Keep it up, Arya. Interesting. Maybe we'll find some big monsters at some point. Okay, there's not a lot else I want to do today. This first week will probably be faster paced like this, where we just go in, complete a quest for Tanya, and otherwise just learn stuff. <laughs> Guys, next time Let's Play Rune Factory 2. I'll meet you all tomorrow morning. We'll continue down this path of childhood and fun and, you know, try to make this last a little bit before we have to get serious and do everything. See you all next time, and I hope you all have a fantastic day. Goodbye.